Hello all. In this tutorial, we will see how to create a new program in iView Developer with a Ethernet IP tag being imported. So first click on the file. You click on new. You type in a project name, which is Ethernet IP, for example. You click on next. So here we do have a display size of 7 inch so we are using IV07M click on next here we have a link type so select the link type as Ethernet and device server as Allen Bradley and we do have the server as the con control logic Ethernet IP tag click on next here we do have a parameter to be configured which is the IP address so you type the relevant IP address so 192.168.254.128 or whichever is actually relevant for the module and configure a timeout time retry counts click on finish and now we have a program being created now we need to import the tags so under the ap underscore one which is the application program you can see links and under the links we do have the link one which is the same which we have created just now and under that you have tags so you double click on tags and select link one and here we do have import so click on the import tags now when we export the tags from the RS logics it will create two files one is the L5K file and the other one is a CSV file so in the IV developer we require only the CSV file so when we create import tags it will open and it will open up the window and then we will be able to select this relevant CSV file so here I'm going to export the PLC and the hyphen tags so which is actually a CSV file so you double click on that and then it will show where it is coming from and what's the date it's been created and all the relevant details and here we need to select the delimiter as comma and you click on continue and then it will it will import all the files all the tags from the file and you click on import so it has Im imported all the tags Ethernet IP tags to the tag list you can click on the cross mark so that you'll be able to close the tag table now you can create an object say for example a bit button you can double click on that and then you'll be able to select the tag and then you can click on the link one and then you'll be able to select a tag from it so you can simply double click on the run mode that is a tag which was exported from the RS logic software and then we have imported into INI view developer software and now it is available in under your tag list so all the bold characters are the relevant so this is a bit data object and so this is a bit data tag and you can press tag ok and then that will finish the importing of all the tags from an RS logic software and then we will be able to configure all the tags. Thank you for watching this video.